Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial and today we are building the Adams radial tank for I believe the LSWR I could be wrong but um, yeah this is the Adams radial tank in a great pretty green livery I based this off of how the ra the radial tank at the Bluebell railway looks well me you know me and train fan did because he also helped with this one including Peter he helped Peter slash Trojan too, you know. I keep on calling Peter for some reason. I don't understand why. I just don't understand why I want to keep calling him Peter. But um, anyway, so uh, yeah, he is currently in his Bluebell Railway livery. Um, so yeah, let's let's start this. So you're gonna want a you're gonna want a get red concrete and put it three blocks above the track and make it one two three four five make it five blocks long and the blocks above the anvils we're gonna delete those and replace it with uh, pistons so the buffers for the coupling and also to make the you know the pistons slide out so I'll put a lever there put it down um, okay, then put, well, if you're not in this version, you want to use Acacia or Brick, whichever one, but since we are in, since we are in 1.19, I'm using Mangrove, because it just looks the best, and we're going to put that under there. Let's get the carpet, and cover that up, and these are going to be nether brick fences. Put them there. Okay, now let's let's work on the footplate. The first part's gonna be three blocks long, like that. Then put two green concretes there. You'll see how that's gonna come into play later. And we're gonna want to make this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 14 blocks long. And then, depending on what version you're in, you want to use warp stairs. If you're not in this version, just use uh, dark prismarine stairs. Get a warp slab. If I. Oh, wait, no, that's my bad. We don't need those. Uh, this is just another stairs. We got our cap stairs there. So then we're gonna wanna add four more. One, two, three, four. And then we're gonna make the buffer beam again. And we're gonna copy the same thing we did we did with the foot play on that side. Copy on this side. So one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, now we got the foot plate done. Um, let's just go ahead and work on the wheels before things start getting out of hand. So, let me see here. Um, you're gonna want to put it. Okay, so you want to go down two blocks, right to right here, and then on the rails, you're gonna place a stair there and you're gonna make a circle like so there we go and you wanna skip two blocks and do the same thing and then skip two more blocks Now we're gonna start on the uh, driving wheels. So you're gonna put green block there and make an X, and then put the stairs around it. And we're gonna want to make two of these. So skip another two blocks, make the same plus sign. And 
there we go. Those are our driving wheels. Now you're going to want to skip one, two, three, four. Skip four blocks. So one, two, three, four. Three, four. that okay then you want to just make a simple little tiny wheel here those are going to be the um, trailing wheels I believe that's what they're called I don't know uh, I'm tired I'm losing my sense of railway terminology I'm sorry um, let's go ahead let's extend these down these are going to be our pistons right yeah Put the blackstone buttons all across them. And I'm gonna put. Oh, I just got an achievement. It's, uh, Wither Skeleton Skull right there on both sides. Now we can make the piston rods. So get smooth stone slab, and you're gonna wanna make this five blocks long. Sorry, from here, so one, two, three, four, five. And one block down the middle. Then you're gonna wanna get iron trap doors and do the exact same thing with just, but you know, just with iron trap doors. And then we got more slabs for one, two, three, four, five, six blocks, so. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there we go, those are our piston rods. So let's go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. This should be easy. So yeah, just make the pony trucks here. Plus sign. And there we go. Now we just kind of copied the piston rods. So, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, six. Right, okay. And then the iron trap doors. Alright, gotta do that. I can already tell this tour is going to take a lot longer than the uh, than the Trojan one, that's for sure. Um, okay. So, now we got that done. We're going to want to do some of the, you know, we're on filling some of the bottom. So, put black concrete there. And then, Okay, then get another brick slab, put it down there. Right, okay. Um, then you're gonna wanna put black concrete all the way across to the very end. And oh, I forgot to add the mangrove slab here. That's my bad. And then get the nether brick slab again. Get rid of that. It there and you're also gonna wanna fill all that in I believe yes you are um, well I was gonna world edit it but I decided nah I won't so just gotta fill all of this in black concrete and 
there we go. It's all filled in now. So now we can start working on the body of the engine. So let's start in the front with the sweat box door. And we need nether brick slab and nether brick stairs. So from this black carpet, we're going to want to put one nether brick slab and then nether brick stairs like that. And we're going to want to put black concrete. How far? Um, until this button here. So I want to say that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, wait, no, it's out. Wait, that's my bad. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I want to say it's 10 blocks. So, extend that for 10 blocks that way. And now we're going to start the smoke box door. So, put the black concrete there and make a plus there. And then add another brick stairs to the sides. So it's, you know, more curved and all that. Then get a lever. This is for the smoke box door handle. And you're going to want uh, the smoke box to extend three blocks. So we're going to make this. Oh, I can't see. There we go. You got to make it that long. What the? Okay, that was weird. Okay. And that's our box now we're just gonna add the funnel here in the middle and add another brick style on top of it so there we have at the front and um, inside the boiler now so we get some green concrete and we're gonna want to extend it one two three four five six seven I'm gonna extend it seven blocks back and might as well just fill this all in here Okay, and get out warp stairs and just make it more curved. Okay. Um Alright, let's start on the side tanks now. So the side tanks are gonna go from here. They're gonna go Oh, yeah, up to there. Okay, so we've got that down. I want to extend it to... Let's just extend it there for now. Okay. Oh, right. We've got to extend it over one. Yeah, there we go, okay. Um, oh, also, random thing, if you're wondering why the terrain looks like this, I have a Seasons thing on, so, um, you know, I have it set to fall right now. Well, anyway, um, so, yeah, here we got the side tanks, and, okay, extend this there and make it go sideways send it up one block and punch some holes right there now we're gonna want to put warp stairs along the side and we're gonna want to get warped slab and fill in that green part that was left um Let's go ahead and do the dome, just to get it over with. So you want to go one, two, three, four, four blocks down, and get dark prismarine slab, and place it on top of there. And forgot what this is, uh, but you want to 
but you're gonna go three down, place it that there. And then the whistle is gonna be a birch fence. And oh yeah, that's a prisoner ring wall, I believe. Yes it is. Um okay. Now let's add black stained glass. Put it in those holes. And get black carpet. Put it on those sides and then get another brick slab. Put it over like that. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you wanna extend this or you wanna extend it up by three, extend it back by two. Just like so. Add the warp stairs and warp slab two blocks over. Very good, very good, okay. Um what next? What next? Um okay so from here add green concrete, make it go all the way down. Same here. And add black con black carpet, my bad. And another brick slab. And there we pretty much have our cab roof and our cab door. Um now just need the bunker. That's gonna be three blocks up, extend it all the way to the back. side. You'll see why soon. And to finish it off, I want to get another brick slab and black concrete and you want to make a pattern. So it's going to be slab and then black concrete. Let me switch these so it's easier. Slab, black concrete, slab, Black concrete slab, black concrete slab, black concrete and slab. And you're gonna wanna put black carpet over that. Just that it looks nicer. And there you go, that's the main body, so now we can do all the detailing and stuff, which will be relatively easy. So let's go ahead and do the cab detailing since we're over here. Oh uh, we don't have to add this because those use item frames and stuff. Invisible item frames, those are hacks. If you want to use invisible item frames, you can, but I'm going to be using regular item frames. Um, or you can just add no item frames at all, but I'm going to add them anyway. So inside cab, you're going to make this art shape. So, like for here, it's going to be these six blocks. I believe that was six, right? Yeah, that was six. And add the one on top of there. And then... There. Okay. And... Let's get these up there. And let's add the windows. So you want to get iron bars. And put them for the back windows. Oh, wrong place. Okay. Now, you get item frame item frames and, and iron shovel and then you want to get some clocks and okay so for the clocks it's going to be a formation like that those are the gauges and Okay, the shovels are gonna be like that. And then put the shovels there. Okay. And now you wanna punch a two block tall hole there. And put a smooth stone slab there. And then a block of coal there. And you'll see what that's for later. And now we're going to add seats and the levers, so the levers going to be like that. This one's going to be down. And punch another two block tall hole. Put a stone brick slab there and campfire there. 
I can go ahead and fill this back part in with stone. I did that? Yeah, I did it. Okay. Wait. Okay, now I did it. So that's the cab detailing. Now let's just go ahead and add the coal in the bunker. So you want blackstone slabs and block of coal. So okay. Okay, I see what I did here. So what you're gonna wanna do is wait, hold on. Okay. Add three blocks of coal there. There. One down. And then another one down. Wait, what? Hold on, guys. Technical difficulties. Um. Oh, I know I did. Okay, keep that open. Nothing there at all. Two, wait. No, I did that wrong, too. Two blocks there. And another one there. Now for the slabs, just gonna wanna put a slab there. Slab there. Two slabs there. Another slab there. And another one there. And there you go, that's your coal bunker. Let me just see if that's covered up. And indeed it is. Okay. So now we have the bunker taken care of. Now we can do all the buttons and stuff I really don't want to do. But we're going to do it because it looks nice. Okay. So from the smoke box, we're going to want the buttons like this. This is like the lining. And skip two blocks, same thing. Skip two blocks, same thing. And for the side tanks, I'm gonna put it like so. And there, that's the side tank lining. Let's go ahead and add the numbers. The numbers do look a bit weird. Anyway, sorry for that. Uh, numbers look a bit weird. But, um... Oh, well, we're just gonna have to make do. Um... Okay, well, yeah, there we got the numbers. And... So now we're gonna add some chains, starting from there all the way to... Smoke box. Like so. Okay. And. Alright, uh, yeah, we got some extra detail to do. So, add worked slabs on top of the piston there. And over here, you're gonna wanna add two green concrete. One stair, one slab, two acacia buttons. So, repeat that on the other side. Hold on. Let me just switch these out. Okay. And there we go. Um, what else do we have to do? I know for a fact that that's not it. Oh, right. Okay. We gotta do... Oh, I didn't do the lining for this side. And then... Numbers. 
There we go. Um, and add iron bars inside. That's the hand railing. You need that to get up the locomotive and do the cab. Um, then add buttons on the bunker like so. And are there any on the back? No, there's not any on the back. Is there anything else we have to do? Just double check. And no, I think that is everything. Yeah, yes indeed it is. So, that was the Adams Radial Tank Locomotive tutorial. Uh, that's the second tutorial I've done on this Astro's Locomotive Work series. And I look forward to do doing more because they're actually kind of generally fun. Whenever I'm not tired. So, yeah. I hope to see you guys next time. And before I go, actually, I want to show you the next engine that's up. And it's not completely finished yet, but it's this one. This is the LBSER C Class. It's going to be what I'm making a tutorial on next, so look out for that. And these are also coming soon. And all of these. Not these. Uh, you know, all of these. Don't worry about those. I really need to redo those. They're terrible. Um, terrible summer whale stuff. Except Knickerbocker. Knickerbocker's fine. Will I make Summer Wells? Tutorials. Mm, not for a while. Okay, well, that's about it. So, I hope you guys enjoy. Hope you find this useful. And, goodbye.